Hello everyone, welcome back to another video, and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to maximize your profit during the Jerry event. I know a lot of people don't actually do the Jerry event anymore, but this is how to maximize the amount of damage you get and maximize the amount of money you can make from the Jerry event. So first of all, right when the Jerry Island opens, you're going to want to pawn Jerry Pondfish for Yetis and for other rare creatures like that. You're going to want to have a rock pet equipped. Doesn't matter the level. Just a rock pet. You're going to want to have full snowsuit armor for the full set bonus. Um, no snowballs will be used. You're going to want to have... Um, well, if you're using the full snowsuit armor, you're not. it doesn't matter which cannon you use. You could use the snow blaster or the snow cannon. And it doesn't really matter, but the first magma cube is going to spawn there, right in the front. And then the second magma cube, well, so you're going to want to sit on your rock. Because if you're not sitting on your rock, you won't take anti-KB from these things. You're going to want to teleport your rock to the right side. That is where Maggie is going to spawn, the second magma cube. Then you're going to want to go... All the way to the other side of the map, all the way to the left, this is where Qbert is going to spawn, and you're going to want to take him out as well. And also, especially when they get bigger, make sure to move your crosshair up and down when they're jumping to get the most amount of hits off on them as you can. So now you're going to want to go back to the start, and hopefully... You can get your rock to come. It takes 15 seconds for it to come back every time that it does. And then you're going to want to go back here and kill all of the um, like liquid hot magmas and things like that and get the power-ups um, from the actual um, other things. Then you bet um is going to spawn over here on the right side that was a voice crack please don't say anything about that um and now all of the magma cubes going forward will spawn in this front section in the middle so just set down your rock sit on it so you get the anti kb you can also do it with a horse to be a little bit more um flexible with where you're positioned you don't have to sit in a single spot but it doesn't really matter especially when the magma cubes are coming from a certain angle and once you do enough jerry events you know exactly what that angle is and especially on big magma cubes like this you're gonna want to go up and down like that so you can hit it the maximum amount of times possible so as you can see eight ball spawned and i'm gonna try and demonstrate it here you just go up and down, so you hear like that constant dinging. And you don't want to see the snowballs that are just missing it. You just want to constantly be hitting it. And I'm in a pretty sweaty lobby, so all of us have our rocks and our snowsuit armor. Some of us don't, but most of us have snowsuit armor. Well, I mean, a few of us have it, but the few of us that do know how to do this. Um, and you just basically move your mouse up and down constantly if you're on a snow cannon get 100 damage and then come to wherever the areas the things are going to spawn remember the first one will spawn in the middle second one will spawn on the right the third one will spawn on the left and then the fourth one will spawn in the middle now wait. fourth one will spawn i honestly forget um you can rewatch the video to see where they will all spawn, because um, I honestly forget. And then you just collect all of your gifts, and don't sell them right away. Wait until the prices are high, and then you can sell all of them for an inflated price. So yeah, that was just a quick tutorial on how to do the Jerry event in Hypixel Skyblock. So yeah, and then... um. During these intermissions, um, you're going to want to do the chicken race 
which you can see some people doing it right now um or that guy's doing it right now in some lobbies you'll see a lot more people doing it in the intermission and then once you've already completed all of the chicken race you're gonna want to head over to the pond and ice fish uh so you're gonna want to ice fish for as long as possible and that is that is only if you can catch a baby yeti and you have the right equipment to catch a baby yeti and kill it because therefore you can get the baby yeti pet which can be sold for tens of millions of coins depending on the rarity the epic sells more but the legendary is worth more so yeah i hope this little tutorial will help you guys out and